Hello. Hello there. Um, I wanted to talk a bit about Spellbook. I've gotten quite a few questions about when and where to use it. And I think every dungeon can have can have benefits to using it. Um, if we start off with Brackenhide, there's there's a shit ton of casters first pull, from the first area, second area as well. There's a lot of spell damage coming in. Like if we if we the fuck, this works. You're going. Um, if we look at not the fighters, not the war scourge, hunters, bone crushers. But for example, these mobs, we look at the mystic, earth bolt, wither bolt, there's diseases and poisons. And obviously, in these pools, there's fewer ones. But for example, this is usually together. And here's one mystic, two mystics. And one K speaker. So here it's quite a lot of usages. Last boss as well. You can use on the, the K strikes. I think it's probably not gonna. I'm not sure actually if it helps because you don't really take damage, right? And I don't think it mitigates the absorb. But on tree mouth, you can use it whilst you're consumed. Especially if you're standing on poo poo ground. Here you can. Probably use it on a trap. Ah, oh, it's physical traps, sorry. They're not poison. Probably on nothing there. But I would still recommend taking it for Brackenite. Don't have to, but like, what are you gonna do with 3% more damage? Uh, then if we consider. Hello, <laughs> <No>, Mats. <clears throat> Halls. It's a good place to take it as well. First boss, you might need it when dodging the big AoEs in the second phase. Or... Dragon's Breath. Even if you would skip all dragons, it would be nice on bosses. Um, Hajin, you can help out your healer a bit, but it shouldn't be too big of an issue. The Primal Tsunami, you can spell block the Squall Buffet and reflect the Focus Deluge. Or if you somehow fucked up, you might need your spell block to actually stay alive. Or on the ground shit, I should be able to spell block that. It helps you stay alive. In Naltharus, <clears throat> the Magma Tusk, I would use it on one of the AoE ones. But that's not the main issues. If you look at Naltharus, you've got these Wardens doing Blazing Slash. Which is fire damage. Hurts a shit fucking ton. There's also frontal from trainers and so forth, which you can just use it to blast things. Uh, last boss on the AoE phase, you can use it on this boss when he's following you. When you want to break the chains, you, you can use it. <clears throat> if you look at Uldaman, we've got plenty of places. For example, first boss, first area. And they're doing their bolts and the chain lightnings. Also, if this shield goes up, I'm pretty sure you can spell block the damage from that. A chain lightning stone spike. You know, if you're running out of kicks, there's going to be four casts going on you. Don't really want that. You'll probably die eventually. These guys, if you end up playing them, they do stone bolts and hail stones. If these three cast it simultaneously and none is kicked or stunned, you're dead without a mitigation. Same here, a lot of casts. This boss also slaps as fuck, and he does a naughty combo, so might want to use Spellbook for one of the combos. Same with last boss, good for the breath. Behold is probably the least needed dungeon of Spellbook, I would say. It would mostly be for this. No, that's fire damage, so that's alright. Not gonna help you. So, possibly skip it in Freehold. Yeah, I think Freehold. You can lose the bet with Columns on last boss here. Sure, but you're not going to be able to do that for the entire boss fight. And you want to prio having a good position at higher keys because you're going to end up running out of room. 
under raw i would use it for first boss in case someone fucks up their kicks third boss um third boss because soak shrooms you can leave that so quite a few shrooms and you're gonna have to most likely but that's mostly bosses i don't think there's much to use on trash there nothing that that big of a deal at least here we've got rock more i'm pretty sure the ground you can physical damage but the skitter ground so if you would have to stand on that or something you can use it but it also no not also um no it is um, no i'm i'm right it is nature damage so it does work on the crystalline ground not on the shatter itself uh sunder is nature damage so you can spell block that araxas is nature damage you can spell block that last boss molten crash you can spell block that or the aoe so you can stand in but you can also attack him from behind the wall i don't think it's needed in vortex pinnacle whatsoever like first boss just kick spell effect or you're more than fine there unless you stand in poo poo second boss for the aoe you would use it third boss is if someone fucks up with chain lightning or for skyfall nova just to help you heal her out there's also a couple of trash right where you can use it there but only if you get targeted by multiple things or stuff. actually actually vortex pinnacle You can use it to soak this, but I would have also felt like it could have been magic damage that guy's doing. Alright, thanks for watching.